Michael Gruen is one of those guys who knows everybody. If you need tickets to a Rockets basketball game, he can call Tillman Fertitta, the owner of the team. If you're looking to start a streaming business, he'll connect you with co-founder of Netflix Mark Randolph, Dallas Mavericks owner Mark Cuban, co-founder of Twitch Justin Khan, and former CEO of TikTok Kevin Mayer. Want to invest in crypto? He'll put you in touch with Cameron and Tyler Winklevoss. He's got that kind of juice. Gruen has been an entrepreneur since an early age. When he was 12, he started a successful drop shipping business, selling everything from socks to pet toys. He then founded a company called Creator Edge Media, one of the earliest influencer marketing agencies. Around that time, Gruen also opened a sports management company with an NBPA and FIBA agent. He was also an early investor in Bitcoin and co-founded a company called Frax, a cryptocurrency product that billed itself as the world's decentralized central bank. It was kind of a decentralized fed for crypto. But he is probably best known for co-founding Talent X Entertainment, a talent development company for digital creators. They represent some of the biggest creators on the planet, including, Josh Richards, Bryce Hall, Griffin Johnson, Noah Beck, Blake Gray and more. Gruen obviously has an impressive resume but so do a lot of other entrepreneurs. What separates him is his uncanny ability to network. He gives us some tips to improve our networking skills, don't go to the top, Gruen said, a lot of people will try to go to the top of the food chain, when they shouldn't be there. If you're just looking for advice, don't always go to the CEO. Maybe go to a VP or director. They might be able to be a better help to you. Don't listen to the experts, don't take the advice you see online and just copy and paste an email that they suggest to use. You know how many times I get the Tom Bilyeu copy and paste email? I know that they don't give AF. Also, the more specific you can write about someone, and show that you actually know about them, the more likely they are to respond, said Gruen. Be concise and to the point, he said, I usually try to be funny, and make a couple of jokes, but I also try to be very specific about what I'm looking for. Show them how they can help, if they show me why I can actually be an asset to their business, I'd be happy to hop on a call. You have to create the narrative. People forget that everything has a value prop, said Gruen. Don't ask for anything, Gruen said, only ask for their time to chat. Don't go into the relationship trying to gain a job, an investor, etc. Ask for money, get advice. Ask for advice, get money. Make sure that you're prepared, he said, if you're going to get on a call with someone, make sure that you're prepped. You don't want to show up looking like a fool. Make connections, try to connect people, 